So I just never in my life learned anything from these guys. I used to ask him questions they could they never answer them. I used to ask him about the book of Revelation. He'd be like, oh, brother, the Lord put a seal on that book and we can't read it. I'm like, damn. <laughs> you know what I mean? I remember my school days. I used to, before I go to school, I used to watch the Creeper Channel and shit, wait for my bus, whatever. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I was watching this shit, and the dude, he was on there, he was like, they show, they show like old, like old shit, whatever. Right. And this pastor, he was on there talking about the Hurricane Katrina or some shit. He's talking about the Bible channel, right, TVN? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to watch TVN every day. I, I, I still watch it if I could. Yeah, the boy, he was like, he was like, he's like, I don't know why this hurricane happened. All I do know is God loves you. Like, bro, what kind of, I can tell you why it happened. Oh, he's just reading it. He's just not reading it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Tell you why it happened. It's easy. Transgressions of the people. People don't listen. To That's why a lot of times there'd be a hurricane come through a neighborhood, destroy every house. Maybe like one house right there just standing. Just going down. Same with them California fires and fires in California. The yeah. whole neighborhood burnt, but them just a couple of houses there still standing. Yeah, praise, praise the Lord. Spare your ass. Yeah, it's called uh, direct energy weapons. Same shit how they brought down the towers. That's it's the same yeah. shit, uh, direct energy weapons. That's all it is. Man, they, they've been working on this technology for years. This, it's, it's already perfected. You, you, see the, you see those fires in Greece? Greece too. Yeah, that's my shit. Yeah, yeah well, it's alright. It shows a little sun, but, you know, it's, it gets stupid. But it still shows a little sun. But yeah, man, I'm correct. That's, that's real, man. This devil got some, I mean, he was blessed with the sword. And that sword, that's one of his swords, those satellites that he used for weapons. Shooting down on powerful whatever beams they, they conjured up. I mean, they can make it rain. You see him spray the chemtrails to form artificial clouds. Half the time, the clouds in the skies are artificial. You can watch the, the planes spray this shit and then watch them form fake clouds. You ever seen a storm fire? Have you ever, everybody seen a storm? It's just burnt up, you see? But on the California and Greek fires, a lot of cars, the metal itself, it looked like it was running. You know, fire don't get that hot to melt metal like that, to make it run, turn liquid to liquefy. You see what I'm saying? That's laser technology that gets, that kind of lasers ain't nothing but concentrated fire, man. Yeah, but right. it's, they, they know all kind of frequencies of fire. They've been practicing, they've been creating it, been studying it for years, man. This devil's blessed with the sword. But anyway, the metal was melted, man. They said they had laser beams back in 92 in the, uh, oh, Panama. Yeah, Panama, the U.S. went to Panama. You wanna watch a good movie, watch the Panama Deception. It's bad as hell. It should be on YouTube. It's bad as hell. It's called the Panama Deception. It's a real good documentary. What was that? 80 something? 80, it might have been late 80s, early. It's during, late the, 80s, during, late the, 80s. during the Bush administration. The U.S. military went over there and butchered the people. And they said they was out there with laser beams. Yep. They had, what did they say, backpack laser beams? Yep. Yep. That was back in the 90s they had that shit. You gonna imagine what it got now. devil gonna bring out all his technology. They got they got a gun that can shoot a frequency at you and, and make you shit yourself and make you drop your whole guts out. They got uh they got sonic weapons from anything with sound like you look at a glass and you know you can do it at a high frequency. Yeah it makes you shake to the point where it gets you know it breaks. So they got that shit with your weapons they got they can do that to your eyeballs and your eyeballs like yeah. vibrate the shit. They can melt your brain and yeah. shake yourself vibrate yourself it's definitely ain't no joke. They got weapons to mentally change you into a happy mood, to a fucked up mood, turn you into a killer. They can put thoughts in your head. <laughs> they got this device, they can just talk to you. And you, you think you was a thought popping in your head. They, they was over here with a little thing shooting it at you. Putting words in your head. Oh, wait a minute, I don't see. There's a new one, there's a one. It's just, uh, it's just north of uh, campus. A new, I saw a new tower put up. It looks like one of the weapon ones. 
It looks like it looks like a weapon. <laughs> you know? Oh, it's it's terrible. Just the sight of it, man. It's something else, man. I'm telling you. This devil's gonna turn the volume up. Yeah, he's gonna turn the volume up. I read this a couple days ago. I'm gonna read it. Uh, this is a sonic weapon. It says sonic and ultra sonic we uh, weapons, S uh, USW, are weapons of very types that use sound to injure and, ca and decapitate or kill an opponent. Some sonic weapons are currently in limited use or research and development by military and police forces. Some of these weapons have been described as sonic bullets, sonic grenades, sonic mines. Can you go to the Go to the gate at the top of that. The gate? The gate. There's always going to be a gate when it came down. Is that Wikipedia? Yeah, it's Wikipedia. Oh, it's Wikipedia. Wikipedia. You had to find an article for it. This one says right here, it's uh, uh, the police stands off. It just came out in the news the other day that uh, there was a satellite the United States was worried about. That they was flying up above us. They, they was afraid that Russia had laser uh, laser beams on the satellite. Right, right. They uh, they labeled some of Russia's. That was just last week. They found out that Russia has what they call kamikaze satellites. Kamikaze satellites, man. They ain't good. They're, they're just out there just to go destroy everybody else's satellites. You know? Yeah. Hey, the satellites go down, ain't nothing working. Ain't nothing working. Nothing ain't working. shit working. That's what's going to happen anyway. Yeah. It's going to happen anyway. That's why them boots going to have to go on the ground to the Middle East, the War of Armageddon. Jay going to lose his mind if he can't get on uh, Xbox <laughs> Live. You know what I mean? Shoot. Can't get on Facebook, they're going to go crazy. And when they find out them cell phones ain't working on the lights. Oh, they done. You know, when they can't call 911, you know. Yeah, the even satellite, the satellites go out, man. Even the phones work through the satellite, yeah, all that shit. Man. It's all wireless. Yeah. So most I got a he got a he got something bad in store for the Some bad in store for the Everything they rely on now is gonna vanish away. It's gonna vanish away like that. So everything they depend on, you know, they, they depend on this government to feed them, to protect them. Most high gonna get rid of all of that, man. Hey, really, everybody depends on too much shit. Too much, man. You know what I mean? Mentally, I ain't think, I ain't, you don't get caught up in this world. Mentally, you do, you do, you do, you, you, what you call, you just take yourself out of this world. You, discon you disconnect yourself mind from this world, man. I know you gotta go to work. Don't go to work, you gotta go shopping, you gotta deal with your woman. But there's come a time, you have to disconnect from this world. You have to. Here we go. You yeah. got something? The possibility of a device that produces frequency across vibration, different frequencies. Hey, that's why actually all frequency affects you when you listen to some bullshit rap music talking about adultery. That's coming at you with a frequency that fucks up your spirit. You ever been in a car with some pounds? You can feel it. You yeah. Can feel it. You can actually feel it. Not just the beat, you can feel the voltage. Yeah. You can feel it. Everything's based on frequency. Everything. Hey, the, it's truth too. Esau got something called string theory. And he knows that. Space frequency. Yeah. Vibration of the eyeball. I mentioned it. It says, therefore, and therefore, distortion of vision was suggested by Bruno Research in Wright City in the 1990s were attempted to. In the 90s. That's a long time ago. Demystify exactly. a haunting in his laboratory in This book was a characteristic by a feeling of unease and vague glimpses of gray apparitions. Some detectives work in print of the movie and saw part of Pretty much niggas seeing ghosts and shit. I don't know what they fry your brain, may turn you into a mental retard. Hey, they got, uh, what was it, man? Well, eventually it's gonna come, they're gonna put microchips in everybody's brains. That's what it, that's what they plan to do. Soon they're gonna make it mandatory. You're gonna have to get a mandatory microchip brain implant. It's gonna be able to read your thoughts and everything. Hook you up to the internet. You see Elon Musk? You know who that is, right? He said, he, that's, he wants to see it soon. Everybody with microchips in their brain. I mean, you're going to have it in your hand, too. Right? The scripture said what? In the hand or the head. It's coming. It's here. It's already here. It, oh, just like, too. Like, if you, 
If you don't do what you're told, if you want to buck up against the system, they could just flip a switch and make that microchip fry your fucking brain. That's crazy. That's crazy. What's that scripture in Romans that you're saying? Romans 13. Let her get it. Let her come and talk shit. Look, nigga, I got my shit. I'm eating today, nigga. With your broke ass. Yeah. That's what she's gonna say, too. Yeah. You broke bitch. Yeah, yeah you bum. You can't even take care of your babies. Yeah. I can't wait, man. I can't wait. Then my enemy shall see it. Shame shall come. Shame shall come. Shame shall come. They love seeing the black man down too. Is it about to rain? It looks like somebody happened. My camera be done if it rains. I got the motherfucking. This should look like Chitty Chitty Bang Bang or something. Like fucking. What was it? It's some old patch together shit. I'm surprised it even works. What time is it? It's still early, yeah. Damn, it's still early. I need to decompress my fucking spine. I've been trying to, uh, you know what I mean? I've been trying to crack my back forever. Here's the black bitch again right here. Right there. They rejoice not against me on my enemy. When I fall, I shall rise. When I sit in the darkness, the Lord shall be the light of the and I will bear his indignation from the Lord because I have sinned against him until he came my cause and which you will drink the Lord. He will bring me forth to the right and I will show the righteousness. Then she that is my enemy shall see it, and shame shall come to her, which said unto me, Where is your glory power? That's what that black people That's what that sounds just like a black woman, too. Um, you know, Professor that's what, they, that's what they come up and say, dude. Like, where's your guy? Y'all bullshit. Y'all talking about some bullshit. Shame is going to be this bitch. Shame is going to be the kind of thing. What you call the fist is a spiral sugar. Spike fences and shit in a containment center looking out. <laughs> looking out with a pitiful look in her face. And fucking wait. They gonna be the ones. Wire fence. They be the ones that run to the government for help. They gonna lock your ass up in that camp. Yep. Yep. Only to them that run into each of them. As a, that's why I want him to go to the hospital, bro. Man, you go to the hospital, you go there with a broken bone. Next thing you in there with cancer, tuberculosis. We got all kind of shit wrong with you now. You got AIDS now. <laughs> you you a dumbass if you really go to the if you like quick to go to the hospital. There's something you're not very your first reaction. Yeah, there's something wrong with you. Uh, you got to sometime, I guess. With an emergency. Shit, I'm that guy though, bro. I'm like. Hey, mom, get the, uh, a screwdriver or something, dig it out. Get the whiskey. There's no alcohol peroxide, pour it all in there. Let's get it. Get some comfrey, boy. Comfrey will heal every goddamn thing. Really, if you break a bone, you should be able to set your own cash. I'm the back of place just you can make a cast out of mud. You know that, right? Yeah, that's what they do. Probably, but you can do something. You can make it out of something. But they say comfrey heal that shit quick. It's called a stents. Make a yeah, stent. Stent, yeah. Make one of them. I mean, there's a bunch of things you can do. Besides going to the hospital. They, they got them up in the hospitals, they got uh them antibiotic resistant super bugs up in that bitch. I'm straight. I'm afraid to go to a hospital just to visit people. Hospital is the worst place to be. All them, all them viruses. The all them pathogens floating in the air. I'm straight. Shit. 
say it's cold? Cold. Yeah, it is. I'm trying to keep that shit as a minute. And to get your Yeah, because if it's hot, it would fucking fester even more, man. Yeah. Shit, you still working in a hospital, didn't you? I never did. Like I said, it's a little fucking shit. You ain't get sick all the time? No. You probably get used to it, huh? I don't know. Yeah, I ain't even going up in there. TV shot. I can't remember the shots now. You gotta like, get like six shots now. Every so many years. Like every four or five years. Damn. They do the TV test and put the hair on the skin. Yeah, no losses. You go cool, daddy. Go cool breeze again. Cool breeze. By the sword, that was his blessing. He gonna be the devil, but this is our blessing. And Jacob went near him to Isaac his father. He felt him and said, The voice is Jacob's voice, but the hands are the hands of Esau. And he discerned him not, because his hands were hairy. That's his brother's Esau's hands. So he blessed him. And he said, Well, thou my very son Esau, and he said, I am. See, look at me, if you really think about it, Isaac really knew. When you really think about it, because he's like, hold on, this ain't Esau. When he questioned it, he was going to Yeah. He said, bring it near me, near to me, and I will eat of my son's venison, venison, that my soul may bless thee. And he brought it near to him, and he did eat, and he brought him wine, and he drank. And his father Isaac said unto him, come now, come near now, and kiss me, my son. Especially after drinking some wine, you know, he was feeling good, giving his blessing out, too. Yeah. Um, and it was near death, too. And he came near and kissed him, and he smelled the smell of his raiment, and blessed him and said, See, the, the, and bless him and said, See, the smell of my son is as the smell of the field, which the Lord hath blessed. I hate the smell of outdoors. Bless him, motherfucker. Ain't showered at their book. Man, I hate the smell of a motherfucker cutting grass. It just stinks, man. Therefore, the Most High give thee of the dew of heaven and the fatness of the earth. I say, of corn and wine. Well, let's say we're going to get the dew of the heaven and the fatness of the earth. Go ahead. And let people serve thee. Let people serve thee. That was our blessing in the Bible. The Stay. people are going to serve us. That's servants. And what's, what's, a, uh, what's another word for a servant? It's a slave. Go ahead. Nation, nations. Bow down to thee. Be Lord over thy brethren it and said thy nations, mother's son bow down to thee. It said nations. What did that say? It said nations bow down to thee. Nations will bow down to us. That said the same thing as Revelation. Not these nations. <laughs> Just like Revelation 2 said what? The he to keep my works into the end, to him I give power over the nations. That's the same, that's the same blessing. 
Everyone that curses us. <laughs> and blessed be he that blesseth thee. And it came to pass as soon as hey. Isaac had made an end of blessing Jacob, and Jacob was yet scarce gone out from the pit. Yeah. That's a, that's a hell of a blessing, though, ain't it? Yeah. Hey, that's what, what, what it say? Nations going to bow down to us. Whoever curses is they gonna get cursed. But whoever blesses is they gonna get blessed. You see, Esau ain't been blessing us though. He been cursing us. So his ass is gonna get cursed. But double, double to him, you know what I mean? I think I started having a vision. Well, anyway, the point of the, the, the reading was with Esau's reading, the scriptures with Esau blessed with the sword, his devil was just the fucking mad goddamn scientist, man. He's a mad scientist. And he's gonna come up with nothing but diabolical wicked shit. And not just wicked shit to ruin righteousness, but wicked shit to ruin wickedness and kill and to man people, man. He did it. He he's what the devil death. does, man. He gonna do it. He does wicked. He does evil. And two thirds of Israel done took on his spirit. So yeah, Jake actually gonna go. I mean, I did it too. I went going the military. You know what I mean? You gotta be out your goddamn mind to go join the military. Woo. Go kill some people. But they all, you see that they killed like what, 40 children in Yemen? What is that? Just, yeah. Blew up a school bus. Catching hell, you notice that? Yeah, always. Yemen is always catching hell. That's a poor ass. You should be a vibrant, you should be a vibrant, a vibrant country, man. You should be one of the a key part there. You know, they say Yemen was founded by Shem. That's what the legend says. By Shem. By Shem. Okay. <laughs> that's what they say. But that's a uh, yeah. Jake been down in all over the place, but the Saudi Arabians been over there terrorizing them too. Yeah, they, 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 they a bunch of goddamn, they a bunch of damn devils too. The U.S. has been there for years. Yep, That's years. Why are they over at Yemen though? What? Going to the brothers. They just want to control the whole fucking planet. Oh, everybody, everybody. Revelation 12 and 11. Therefore rejoice, ye heavens, and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil has come down unto you of a great wrath, because he knows that ye have but a short time. <laughs> yes, yeah, so this devil, he, he making moves quick right now. Hey. He's constantly playing away, destroying you, make you go off, you know what I'm saying? Make a new reality TV show to put people to sleep. He finds pleasure in that. Yeah. He finds pleasure in that. Deleting all your channels, censor us on the internet. Taking fucking milk out of cockroaches. <laughs> yeah, they making milk from fucking roaches, bro. <laughs> I forgot what I know what scripture says that they diligently search out wickedness or something like that. And they make a diligent search out of wickedness. That's me, so like, why do you think so? Oh, that's true. Come back to the little six year old with the Somali at that point, right? And I am not making this up. They got plenty of cockroach milk over there. Listen, them Somalians, they live with roaches, and they don't call exterminators. They don't kill them or nothing. And I'm them. not making this shit up, man. They don't, in the apartment complex management is constantly, actually, uh, uh, corporate is always complaining to the management to get on them. But ain't nothing they can do. Because some motherfuckers, they think these folks will live with them. And, you, know, you, know, you know how Amalek might be eating them. That's their people. Eating lice, right? Yeah. They might be eating them motherfuckers, man. That's crazy, man. They look like and you roaches. can't clean them houses. You can't clean them apartments as full of roaches. You don't want to take them home. They curse. Nobody got no hazmat uniforms. Man. Hey, roach is actually a spiritual insect. You fuck on that, man. That roach is actually that's a that's a curse. The Lord uses roaches to curse you. Because if you ain't fucking, if you ain't right, bro, the mom, the Lord, they gonna fuck you up with a plague of roaches, man. Man, you go in there, you see your mom and dad roaches, you see their actual babies following them. 
It'd be a whole bunch of little tiny little dots following them, man. You remember when we was at a park, we had roaches? Oh, yeah, right, right. And we did it. There's some shit we got rid of. We was praying to the Lord. We got rid of it. For real. But I remember I had this bitch over one night, bro. And, she, and a roach came up. And she was like, oh, that ain't nothing. I called my cousins at my house. Oh, bro. She's like, this was my people. Oh, my God. And she actually said about a roach. Ooh. She said, that's my people. Ooh. Whoa. Elon. Spirit of Elam. Yeah, Elam would eat dinner with a rat and a roach. Yeah, right. He's sipping out a soup with a rat right there with him. Yeah, Elam foul, man. At least Esau made no better. So you know the Israelite woman ain't gonna do it. Israelite see a, a fucking rat, she's running for her life. Like, ah! You know any Israelite woman is not afraid of a rat? So what are they gonna do when the, the shit hits the fan? And they getting chased by monsters. They terrified of rats. Their worst fears. That's some crazy shit. I just can't wait to bury some eating rice and I'm already be slinging them with a catapult. I can't remember what movie it is. Dude got buried alive over in Afghanistan. And the whole movie, he's in the, in the, in the coffin trying to get out. He got a cell phone phone with people trying to get some help. I ain't seen that. Yeah, yeah, it's a bad movie. Dude, uh, dude that play um, uh, Deadpool. For real? Yeah, he's in a movie. He's in the coffin the whole fucking movie. The whole movie is in the coffin. That's some scary shit. It's a bad movie, though, man. That's a bad movie, man. He never made it out. <laughs> he did? I don't know. Damn, I ain't trying to watch that movie. My nigga died. That had to make me cross off. Oh, I was hoping I had to watch it. I was hoping he was going to die. Damn. I was hoping. Movies be having bad endings nowadays, don't they? <laughs> I ain't gonna America going to have a bad ending. Oh, I got to find that movie again. Yeah, What's his name? Ryan Reynolds? Yeah, you can do a search. It's in there. It's in the search. Find it. Find it. Find it. It's his movie. I don't know if it's his movie. Yeah, Ryan Reynolds. You can do a search. It's in there. It's in the search. You can find it. It's his movie. I can feel whatever you want. It's whatever you want. That dude's a fucking clown. It's a fan. Yeah, he's Sodom. fucking gay. He's a sodomite. He's a open sodomite. They turned Deadpool into a fucking sodomite. They turned him out. I mean, the movie was good, but it had too much faggot shit in it. Which one? The first Deadpool. I ain't seen the second. I ain't seen it either. <laughs> Man, I liked it all except for that gay shit they had to put in there. Yeah, they turned this faggot out. They always got to put some fag shit and ruin the movie. Yeah, no, they just went to the extreme with it, too. I mean, it was doing good, and they fucked it up, you know? Colossus? That's the only thing about American. We can fuck. They don't give you nothing. Nothing. They just show Colossus for a minute. He's a Russian, right? Yeah, that's Peter. Uh, he's in that next thing. Peter, fuck, I'll forget his last name. I don't remember him being Russian. You Russian? I don't remember him. Damn I it. Was, that's what he grew up in the circle. He had Kitty Pride with him or something. Was yeah. that Kitty Pride? Yeah. That was a girl back in the yeah. 80s. Yeah. I used to be an X Men fanatic, bro. North, high, west, and north, high, and I still got a stack of X Men comics. Their main writer back in the 80s came to find out he's a fucking faggot. Chris Claremont. Dude, that messed me up. I found out he was a fucking homosexual. But goddamn Chris Claremont, are you serious? Can't have nothing. You don't even want to find out nothing about your favorite actors or writers. You already know them. Yeah, they're a bunch of weirdos. What's up, bro? You know the kingdom is at hand. You ready for the kingdom of heaven? Yeah. America about to be destroyed. You know that, right? If you're not on that side, you're obliterated. You ready for that fire? The fire. You got to wait. That's a joke. But no, nah, man. I believe what I believe. <laughs> That's how you ready for the fire. He said you got some weed. Wow. 
Hey, he's a, he's in a zombie state, bro. He on something. He on some pills or some lean or something. He can't afford lean. He's sitting there on 815. I don't know. 815. Let's go for two days. <laughs> Actually, I'm not probably with that. Like about a half hour ago, and all that yapping, I started getting dizzy or something. I already had a, I didn't drink enough water yesterday before I started fasting. You got a fucking headache. Burn, put a burn. Yeah. A little burn. It's actually not bad at all. This is actually been the easiest one besides the fucking head. Hey, righteous shall be granted. Hey, the Lord said, you ask, you shall receive. And we ain't asking the Lord for no bullshit. We ain't asking, Lord, please give me a million dollars. Lord, please give me this record deal. Put me on. Nah, bro, we praying that the Lord destroys this place, gives us the neck of our enemies. That's what we praying for. Y'all be praying for some bullshit. We pray all this shit get destroyed. We praying, we praying for some real shit. You know what I mean? You think about the bullshit these people pray for? They send their father and their heavenly father for some bullshit. You gonna sit there? What, what's that scripture, bro? How they be praying with repetitions like the heathen do? Oh, that's Matthew six. There's another one. Maybe that is the one I'm thinking about. But their prayers. What's their prayers are an abomination? Let's read that one. Proverbs 24. I'll lose 28. You know? It is 28. Proverbs 28. 9. He that turneth his. Oh, yeah, that's it. He that turneth away his ear from hearing the Lord, even his prayer shall be an abomination. Right, so these people's prayers are an abomination. So it's like I said, they be praying for some bullshit. They, people, you got people actually saying prayer, praying to the Lord for money, praying for fame, praying for a husband or a wife. Bro, we praying, praying that the Lord's kingdom comes. What did the Lord say to pray for? He said, pray to the, our Father, Lord in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done. And he said the only thing to pray for is what? Give us this day our daily bread. He didn't say give us a million dollars. People praying for wealth and riches and a new home, a new cat, a new car. And the Lord is just going to kill y'all for that. Matthew 6 and 21, for where your treasure is, there where your heart will be also. Yep, where your treasure is, that's where your heart's at. So our treasure is the kingdom of heaven. That's our treasure. Our treasure is the Holy Spirit. Yahweh Shad. Yahweh Basham Yahweh Shad. Basham Rakakwadas. That's our treasure. I'm gonna look at that. I'm gonna do a word search on treasure. That's the spirit. We were just talking about X Men. Your boy wearing an X Men shirt. Oh, Colossians 2 and 3. In whom are hid all the treasures of wisdom and knowledge. That's what we got riches and knowledge over here. Gold, silver, rubies, sapphire, pearls. We dropping pearls and sapphires on y'all. What we got? I think, oh, I got one. What's up, bro? Oh, another one? Just look and do a word search on prayer and go through the Proverbs. 12, 5, 3, 3. Sir, yes, sir. What you are, man. Yeah. This is like, yeah, you believe that? I believe something like 
That's what the Moors teach. Mean though, but what? that's what I'm saying. A race, a tribe of Judah. We ain't saying race. Dominate, we say nation. Who do you think dominates all these sports? The sports, the entertainment. Group. Who's dominating? That means know. that's a special group of people that's doing it. Yeah, yeah. Why did the Lord only give them talent? He, he must favor them. That's a perception. Hey, no, that's, that's not a perception. perception. Hey, what, that's a, what about Tupac? You ever see a? Uh, I see Tupac. You ever see a white Tupac? Eminem don't count because he's actually black. You ever see him? You gotta, you gotta, you gotta keep. Actually, yeah, Eminem's an Israelite. Eminem could be very well Israelite. Yeah. Also, yeah. Also, hey, 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 what's up? What's up? What's up? I gotta get on this bus. Too. Too. No, you going off now. We know you crazy. You, you out of there. Oh, God. I don't, he said yeah. Eminem. Yeah. Hey, we got right now. Tomorrow. The Lord can destroy the earth, for, uh, the America right now. You know what I mean? Monday. If we hear. Well, yeah, if you hear. The dude said, uh, why will God do that? But one of the titles of God is the most high. Most high is whatever. And he gave him the perfect example. He's like, so why, if the Lord did not favor one people over another, why did he give one people so many talents? You know, so many beautiful talents. I mean, like, we go back to the music. Like, he said, like, Tupac. That, that, that's some talent right there, you know what I mean? And no Eminem is... Right, exactly. All the superstars, all the famous people are Israel. They rely on Israel for entertainment. Right. Ain't no heathen that got no good music, and if they did, that was an Israelite. They'd be like, oh, y'all can't do that. Yes, we can. Well, anybody y'all like is the Israelite, yes. Duh. Why, why would we not, why would we like Eden? That don't make sense. Yeah, Eminem is an Israelite, but he is no, not even close to Tupac. Second Amendment 5, 27, among all the multitudes of people, thou hast gotten to be one people, and unto this people whom thou lovest, thou gavest a law that is approved of all. And now, O Lord, why hast thou given this one people over unto many? And upon the root, one root hast thou prepared others? And why hast thou scattered thy only one people among many? That's, that that's, that's a good scripture. The answer should have fucking known better. <laughs> well, you know, because he was feeling the, uh, the affliction. He was crying for his people. You know, David did it too. He cried to the Lord, asked the Lord, why you do this to me? You know what I mean? They should have known better. They should know better. No one don't know how to cry. This boy is walking like dirt, 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 dirt. You see me eat a bicycle bike, and they be all straight up. They wear their red bicycles too. They're like, me, 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 me. Right, I'm. I look like a pimp when I'm on a bicycle, bro. I make that shit look smooth. That's an Israelite. Esau looks like a dork at everything he does. You ever see Esau riding his bike? He got all the gear. He got the $500 helmet. He got the tight ass shit on. Special shoes. They got a $10,000 helmet. I believe it. All that shit's expensive. 
I was looking at them. $10,000, man. They help you go faster. They got a screen inside of them. It's, it's kind of dope. You can eat them like that. Bite. They got them bites to weigh two pounds. $10,000. I like my bike, but my bike's not dope. $300,000 bike. Woo! Hey, Y'all see they got the, uh, they got, <laughs> they got the things for $60,000 now, uh, it's like a hover, you know, like the little hover shit? What's these things called? The fucking, my brain's just super functional. Motherfucking goddamn drones. You know how they got the drones with all the little propellers and shit? Then they got some shit like a drone that you can hop on that bitch and ride it. Like a hook ride. They call it 60,000. Like yeah. But it's got, I mean, it's just like a drone that you fly in the air, though. 60 G's. They said you don't even need a license. Battery only lasts for 20 minutes. Hey, that's how you win the end times, though. What's that, Daniel? Daniel said the knowledge shall increase in the end. What's up, bro? You know, you know the kingdom of heaven is at hand, right? The most high finna destroy this place. I don't know much about religion, man. Wait, I don't know nothing about religion either. I ain't got a religion. I got truth. I don't know anything about uh, faith. Let's put it that way. Faith? You got no faith? Yeah. So you're just a hopeless man walking to and fro. Just, you just blind. Right. That's it? Pretty much. Right. Right. I, if I didn't know the truth, I would be too. You know, you're not, you're not concerned about you ain't gonna try to change that, or you just, you just have to. He don't gave up a hope, all hope. Yeah, probably. I'm that's, with you. That's hard. That's but, we, hard. but we know the truth though. The Lord gonna come back and bring fire to this place. He's gonna destroy America. We're gonna enslave our enemies. And that's gonna be the end of it. And then we all gonna rejoice. What? What is that scripture you read? The, uh, the oppressors are gonna be our servants. I got a bookmark that one. Where was that at? Isaiah 14. I want to read it again. Isaiah 14. You need to read it again. That's what well, I That's Isaiah 14. I'm pretty sure. And that's what this world does to a person uh, and make him just hate the life. I mean, we live in a world where pretty much you better off dead, bro. I'm, you know, I'm partially with him, but I know the truth. Man, I don't know where to start, so. Isaiah 14 and 2. And the people shall take them and bring them to their place in the house of Israel shall possess them in the land of the Lord for servants and handmaids, and they shall take them captives who captives they were, and they shall rule over their oppressors. So we're going to rule over our oppressors. We're going to enslave them according to the Bible. Yes, our oppressors, they're going to go into slavery. That's going to happen according to the prophecy in the Bible. And you can't stop it. Hey, get that revelation. Revelation 13 and 10. He that lead it for two captivity. That's Satan, bro. He that lead it for two captivity shall go into captivity. The Bible said in the New Testament, that's the New Testament. It says, He that lead it for two captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. So the Bible said, He that lead in captivity shall go into captivity. So in America, let's ask everybody a genius question. See how smart y'all are. Who was put in captivity in America? Anybody answer that? So guess who gets to go into captivity? It said, he that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword, whose blessing was the sword? Esau. He that kills with the sword shall be killed with the sword. Oh, here's the patience. In the faith of the saint, that's faith. Your boy said he ain't know nothing about faith. But that's our faith. Did he say that was the faith? Yes, here is the patient and the faith of the saints. So we got great faith. We got faith. 
Well, the face is the things hoped for, not seen, right? Because you can. Yeah, they really are. That's gonna be another way they can build the imperial kingdom. They had them. They had them uh, school books in the elementary schools that called the slaves immigrant workers. They didn't call them slaves. They called them immigrant workers. They trying to write slavery out the history books for real. But they can be like, why does it matter? That was a long time ago. Yep. Could go right through you and fuck your whole shit up, bro. He know that shrimp. Oh, my mom, she went to the hospital, bro. The doctor. Talking about she got an allergy test done. Find out she was allergic to shrimp. And she she always I always tell her like, why are you eating that? She oh she said she is allergic to shrimp and cockroaches. And I've been told her that shrimp was a cockroaches in the sea. But they be munching on them things, bro. That's like delicious. They actually munching on shrimp, munching on swine's flesh. They eating them catfish, eating some honey baked ham. What kind of abominable? They be eating lobsters. They be really eating lobsters out here, bro. A lobster look like a goddamn alien got antennae, fucking claws and shit. Y'all eating that? He over there laughing like, whoa, 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 whoa. Actually, actually, Elon's vegetarian. Most of them they claim to be. Now, him, yeah, most Hindus are vegetarians, actually. At least they claim to be. But he, he eating ass. Oh, yeah, that's why they come over here. Oh, they'll get a beautiful Israelite queen. That was a oh, half a liar right there. cursing them assholes out. I think the rush is over out here. That was that act. It was that nine to five rush right there. My back feels like it's about fucking snap, son. I let me read the rest of this. I'm gonna decompress. That's why I try to decompress. I can't do it. It's good. Uh, for real. You know, I think I see her one day. She's always, every day she's sitting You can't buy me one day if the fuck is beautiful. Nah, if I see that being like that, I, I didn't understand what she was saying. Like, I know I'm not beautiful, I'm an ugly motherfucker. She must have seen this picture. The woman don't come up telling me I'm beautiful. That'll never happen. Right? Men ain't supposed to be beautiful anyway. We're supposed to be, we're supposed to be rugged and rough. That being the kingdom for me. Angels were beautiful. When the Lord fixed my mess. Terrifying. He fixed my snaggle too. Hey, he didn't say that. What about the queen of sheep? When the Queen of Sheba saw the, uh, <laughs> when she saw the uh, servant of King Solomon, she's talking about how fly he looked. Let me get this. I want to read the rest of the Isaiah. And that shall come to pass in the day that the Lord shall give thee rest from thy sorrow and from thy fear and from the hard bondage wherein thou hast made to serve. Actually, I might as well keep going. Thou shalt take up this proverb 
against the king of Babylon, but now this applied to America. Y'all gonna talk about Donald Trump like that? <laughs> that shall take up this proverb against king of Babylon and say, how has the oppressor ceased? The golden city ceased. Oh, you did read that earlier. So this shit been to cease. Shit looking weird out here. It's gonna look a lot better when the Lord destroys this shit. What a goofy looking motherfucker. That's my girl right here. Look like a like a fucking look like Mr. Potato Head. Yeah, I can't put a finger on I knew he looked familiar. Ethan. Like I seen you somewhere, bro. That's Mr. Potato Head. Ethan. Oh, here come your boy. They be the ones that scoff the most. What's up, bro? You know the kingdom's coming, right? Can't stop it. That's what I'm hey, You know, really, that's what we're supposed to be teaching. Tell them the kingdom's with that hand. I'm gonna say that a lot more. The kingdom's coming. I wonder how you say that in Hebrew. Malak, how you say Malak? I'm, I'm stuttering. That's your girl. Huh? Sick? Yeah, I got a headache. I ain't got sick of the way, but I pray to the Lord. I must have been doing something right, I don't know. But I ain't been sick in like a year, at least. It's Matthew 3 and 2. It says, the saying, repent ye, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Oh, that's the best scripture. You're supposed to repent because the kingdom's at hand. Wow. I'm tired of looking at these people. Look at this dude down here just looking at us. I see you, bro. Fucking weirdos out here. Police. You're a fire chief. Good faggot. Yeah, back to 10 and 7. I'm seeing him put this fire out. So, as you go, the priest saying the kingdom of heaven is at hand. I'll read that from the top, though. Matthew 10 and 5. These 12 you have shot sent forth and commended them saying, Go not to the way the Gentiles. Go not to the Gentiles. This is for the camera. So the Bible clearly says, You're not saving Gentiles. Go ahead. To the city of the Spirit, to the city not, but go rather to the lost of the house of Israel. We're supposed to go. That's what we're supposed to actually be doing, teaching. It said we're supposed to go to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. It didn't say go to the Hamites and the Edomites and the Canaanites. And all these other heathens. Read that again. And, then, uh, and go right to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. So why can't these fucking assholes? I mean, I know why they can't get it. You got you read that scripture a thousand times of vocab alone. He'll just say they don't mean that. Oh, what the fuck does it mean then? Fucking assholes. He just want clothes money. I wish vocab would come out here again, man. I actually I apologize to the Akim for being nice to him. You should have cursed his ass out. That nigga died. Yeah, bro. I hope he has a. I hope he should get on World Star Hip Hop. His, de his death is on World Star. He won't be famous so much. So one day he gonna go out there and heckle somebody. He's gonna get fucked up. Did y'all see that video with dudes by the bitty mother? Yeah. yeah. I fucking poke cap. Fucking my mom. What a fucking weirdo. Don't he have a master? Yeah. All right, so I guess he's going for a doctor that I heard. I don't yeah, know. Right, something like that. He's up there. He got some degrees. That degree don't mean shit. He going to get some degrees, all right? Degree Fahrenheit. <laughs> but there he was. He got to him Celsius or Fahrenheit. That's going to, you know what I mean? We don't look pretty for him. Nah. He's in denial. Every day. Go ahead. He said what? Who? He said who is nice? He's trying to be cool with him. We should have cursed his ass out. 
That's all we deal with the most high hatters do. Go ahead. It says, and as ye go, preach saying the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Yeah, we supposed to teach the kingdoms a hand. I ain't never heard Bo Cat Malone teach the kingdoms a hand. You ever heard him say that? He say the kingdom's coming? He think he already in the kingdom. Fucking Bo Cat Malone. What a bitch. Dr. James White looking like the Grinch who stole Christmas. He got a whole hand riding with him. Is she cold? Is she cold? Is not the hood? Nah, that's sweet. He said to sit down. He, he, uh, he pretty much tried to run away and shit. The only reason why he came back because the brother was talking shit about him. Hey, oh, whatever the fucking name is. They no, got his ass. Just, just give it up and stop. Okay, just stop. You're very for yourself. You know what I'm saying? Vocab, you little bitch. So, but if I see him again, though, he getting it, man. You better not come around here, Vocab. Talk to that. Yeah. We ain't gonna talk to him. This is gonna be a curse out. Because we was actually trying to just to disprove him, though. We didn't try shit. The Lord shit it all over us. But you can't debate with a guy like that, you know what I mean? He won't acknowledge you got anything right. He said fucking Ty the city of, what'd he say? He said the city of Tyree was in Iraq. Thank you. Motherfucker, retarded. Uh oh. Hey now. How y'all doing? What's happening? All right, Captain. So you know the kingdom's a hand, right? Uh -huh. The kingdom of heaven. Kingdom of heaven, that's right. It's, it's coming soon. It's not that's here right. yet. That's right. Let his will be done on earth as it is in heaven. going to destroy America with fire. Oh, all right. With fire. Have a good one. With fire. All right. <laughs> that is a good way to get it started, though. All right. All right. Good boy over here. What's up? Uh, that look like Jebediah. Jebediah Springfield. They got a beer and shit. What's the same? Jeremiah 6 and 17. Also, I said, Watchmen over you saying, Harkin to the sound of the trumpet. You got to harken to the sound of the trumpet. You gotta listen to the sound of the trumpet. Right now, we blowing that trumpet. Y'all supposed to listen. If you're not listening to us, that means you're being disobedient to the Most High. It says, therefore hear, ye nations, and know, O congregation, what is among them. Hear, O earth, behold, I will bring evil upon this people, even the fruit of their thoughts, because they have not hearkened unto my words, nor to my law, but rejected it. They don't listen to shit. They don't listen to none of the Lord, laws of the Lord. So what? I gotta chase that paper. So what? I gotta get paid. I gotta go commit adultery. They don't, he tell you the kingdom's coming down. I don't care. The fuck that got to do with me. What? We about to get a new income tax check? What? You know, they interpret all kind of fucking stupid ways. Uh, Trump about to give us some money? Nah, nigga. Trump ain't giving y'all shit. This ain't, he, he ain't like George Bush. Yeah, GW. George Bush gave everybody that, uh, that extra income tax in the summer or something. Yeah. They ain't never gave him credit for that, but they cashed that check though, didn't they? They cashed that check, bro, but then say, oh, fuck that. Fuck GW. Oh, G, I miss GW. He had the best, I don't know though. I think Trump got him beat on the press conference. That's a close one. Obama had the boring press conference. He was too, he was too intelligent. I mean, I like hearing the retard start. Hell yeah. Yep. But the Israelite woman go over there taking off. You know, you know, Moab come out this motherfucker. Moab, that's gonna be that Chinese dinner tonight. 
They told Joe that was chicken, that was a robin. What it got burned with them robins? I don't know what's going on. Yeah, what's that? Oh. Man, Chinese been getting caught left and right lately. Yeah. Uh, yeah. They getting caught selling people uh dog meat. They tell y'all it's chicken, but it's really feeding y'all cat, dogs, pigeons, rats. Y'all thought that was chicken, bro. That was a rat. Rat or cat? Rack attack cat. What the fuck is a cats on this? Hey, let me get this first. Matthew 11 and 16. But whereunto shall I liken this generation? It is like unto children sitting in the markets and calling unto their fellows, saying, We have piped unto you, and ye have not danced. We have mourned unto you, and ye have not lamented. So we out here piping, blowing the trumpet. We out here playing that music, and y'all ain't dancing. Y'all should start. Y'all supposed to start dancing. Meaning, you supposed to listen to this word. They, they, they might take it literally, actually start dancing. But it says, we have mourned unto you, and you have not lamented. People should be, everybody should be out here agreeing with us. Like, yeah, man, that's some fucked up shit. Yeah, fuck this fucking devil. You know what I mean? Piece of shit. They should be right there with us. People are losers, bro. Yeah. So if you believe in the Lord, this guy's supposed to be silent. You're supposed to be teaching. Oh, what happened to your boy? It's like Roach Killer. Right? You smell that shit? It's right, bro. Like your boy that was out here last week, Damon Wayne, looking like. What he said? We've been talking the truth. What happened to him? He even came out one day and said, I found out what y'all saying, that Israelite thing is true. I looked it up, it's true. And then he was like, why don't you, you gotta do the work. And he did not do the work, and what happened? He got fucked up, his brother got shot in the head. He got beat up, did they say beat him with a baseball bat? You ever get beat up with a baseball bat before? That's gotta be some gruesome shit. That's what happens, bro. He's lucky he didn't get killed. Remember for months he was trying to come up against him. Yeah, talking shit. Actually, he was trying to actually make a mock. He was. Looking like the lost William brother. Psalms 47 2 for the Lord most high is terrible. He is a greater king over the world of earth. He shall subdue the people under us and the nations under our feet. He shall choose our inheritance for us against the Egyptians. His love shall up. The Most High is going up with the shout. The Lord is the sound of the trumpet. Woo! That Bible always talking about that trumpet, ain't it? That's that blast. It look like used up hose and disposed. That's something you find in the trash can. These hoes look like that old nutted on condom you find in the trash can. Like, what the fuck is that? They look like those monsters and creatures. Look at your board. Verse 7, Isaiah 62, I said 61, I meant to say 62. It says, and give him the rest to be established until he makes wisdom and praise in the earth. What's he doing? 
So the Lord make Jerusalem a praise in the whole earth. And that ain't happened yet. Because Jerusalem is a people. That's Israel. People think that's a city. Jerusalem is a people. That's the nation of Israel. Jerusalem's another name for the nation of Israel. That ain't no praise in our earth. That's a fucking convention. Everybody hate them motherfuckers. Right, right over here in the so-called holy land. <laughs> they done found the shit out of them. They gonna get fucked up. They gonna get fucked up out there. What's up? Yup. And I'm fucking actually got the gate for rain to them. I don't think they justify that. Oh, wait a minute. It's in the town mud anyway. That's the, that's the one. Yeah, the town mud say he gonna fuck little girls. Boys it's just a mere wound. Animals too. Animal, oh yeah. What'd it say? A bitch could fuck an animal and still marry a priest. That's some bugged out shit, man. <laughs> them, them fake Jews are a bunch of weirdos. Yeah, the Bible says. Shit out. 
Bro, I'm not even going to pet a crocodile, let alone try to fuck a crocodile. They turn learn, man, what the hell is crazy? Turn the motherfucker over. <laughs> That's part of them ancient Egyptian mysteries. They, uh, they take the crocodile shit and put it in women's you know, vagina, and that's the uh, oh, first control. Can you imagine the fucking infection? I think I'm Leonard. It's Leonard! Hang your head in shame. Come on, bro. What's up? I missed you. Leonard! 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 I miss my homie Leonard. Do you remember Leonard? Man, we talked him for years and he just don't fuck with us no more. I see you over there, Leonard! Voice cracking. I'm a torment. I'm a get it. Look at this guy. They look like Andy Kaufman. They got a shit made up like the What? <laughs> he might be a bingo too. I'm gonna be fighting with him. He look like an athlete. Right, might be retired. Bingo? Still. How you be a Steelers fan? He done sold out. Steelers fan. Oh, Roethlisberger. What kind of name is Roethlisberger? I don't know. I don't care. Sounded like a goddamn Edomite. It's like that. Now, Roethlisberger's Jake, though. You know, they try to say that goddamn Roethlisberger, goddamn Edomite. Yeah, it's impossible. Oh, they really love. Uh, you was watching the game at my house? Where is Johnny said that? Roethlisberger sounds like a goddamn Jew. <laughs> I was like, he got you. That shit was funny. Sounds like a goddamn. He hates. Well, he a Browns guy. He hates the fucking Steelers. The green sweeper. I don't know. I don't really watch football. I gave up on on them old Bengals. I don't think they can do much. Do nothing. Oh, Marvin Lewis. He gotta go. He been there too long. He don't suck too much dick. They gonna keep him. You can see the nut dried up on his face. He's like the longest head coach you now, ain't he? I told you, bro. I done lost. I stopped watching sports, bro. I'm a Browns fan now. I defect. Try to get him, try to pick him up. See if he jump on your hand. Let's do some bird watching. I think we about done anyway. We talking about football. And birds just kicking it with us. That's how we do it out here. Hey, but look, in the kingdom, the birds gonna rejoice. What is they eating? They eating ants? I'm gonna zoom in on that. Must be a bunch of ants down there or something. Could you imagine eating ants and shit? That's for your food and worms and shit. Shit, just think when that motherfucking famine hits, bitch is gonna be eating worms. So they gonna be eating shit. They gonna be happy when they find out. Yeah, they gonna eat shit. Found the power to old shit. Yeah. It's just like that scripture, bro. They selling, what is they selling? Bird shit? Bird shit. In a head of a, uh, uh, an ass or something, a donkey or something. Yeah. In a head. That's fucked up. Hey, with that, hey, y'all, we out of here. I'm going to say all praises. Yeah, I'll buy something outside. Buy some Rakaka with Uh, That's a wrap.